I mean, for me, first of all, I would say any work we do on ourselves is a prayer. This is a Ho'oponu prayer from Hawaii. And this helps us to go back to the zero point of our own innocence. And a prayer and for me means we are heal healing pain. ourselves, and with that we're healing others, all beings, the world. And expressive arts help us to get in our bodies, into all of our senses so with different ways through movement painting drawing writing storytelling we make our life part of the journey of being and from a way of understanding that I see my pain is your pain your pain is my pain and the more we work together to heal our pain the more we transform ourselves and the world and you might want to speak your name with a movement <coughs> and we will just mirror you back. Mm -hmm. Whoever wants to begin. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And me first. Fiona. Fiona. Josephine. Josephine. work with myself on myself I also heal my ancestors my ancestors support me in my journey and I support them even if they are dead you know so and it's also going forward to the ones who come after us and I what I call earth wisdom What does it mean to be in this body on this planet and how do we become more than just human and access the resources of earth in germany after second world war uh, not experiencing the war myself but the trauma of the war because my parents were children during the war being passed on in different ways and i my soul was called early on to see okay how can i help to promote peace rather than violence and how can i also transmute these forces within myself that might be aggressive or violent um, for me the arts are a gateway to the soul to what makes us human to um, something larger than ourselves to the mystery of being the arts for me are really important in terms of also allowing people to become the authors of their lives and understanding their direct connection to source and to being in the world and having an outlet. So I'm really interested in people's stories and hearing their stories and what made them alive, what is painful, what brings them joy, how are they alive and how can I help or support that process of becoming alive. Let's hold hands. Thank you, sisters, for yeah. coming, for yeah. being here, mm -hmm. for sharing yourselves, for mm -hmm. taking times for yourselves. Mm -hmm. Again, it was an honor and a joy being with mm -hmm. you. Thank you so much. Yeah. All right, welcome. I really invite you to come to um, our Ayada conference and become a member of this amazing organization that can't really do its work without your input.